Hello, fam. Welcome back to the channel. It's your boy Harley Fat Boy Jr. Hope everyone's doing well. Another day in paradise here in Oregon. It's actually pretty late out. Um, kids are dead asleep. Tomorrow's Friday. I hate putting days in here because I don't know when it's going to drop. But hope everyone is doing well. I, unfortunately, am a little under the weather. Tomorrow is Trash Day Recycle Day. And I have a ton of boxes that I need to unbox. Um with some products that I'm uh that I got for my trip out to Sturgis um coming up in August. So yeah, here I'm in the garage. Um pretty exciting times, but I wanted to get all these packages off the table, unboxed, and kind of just go over what I'm gonna be um using uh, as far as uh, the camp out in Sturgis. Um I've mentioned a little bit, some of you who follow the channel kind of already know, but for those of you who are just somehow stumbled across this video right now, uh, yeah, I'm headed out to Sturgis in August. Uh, it's my first time going. I'm riding out from Oregon. <clears throat> I'm going to meet up with a friend in uh, Missoula, spend the night, and then uh, head out the next day. But super excited, but obviously it's my first time going. Um... It's going to be an eight and a half, nine hour trek out there. Granted, everything goes well to Missoula and probably same amount of time from Missoula to Sturgis uh, the day after. But I had to get some uh, I had to get some gear, man, for camping. Uh, being an island boy, uh, quite honestly, I've probably been in a tent, you know, a few times, but never really camped overnight kind of deal. Uh, typically, back in the day, old school, just end up on the beach, whether you passed out or whatever, I mean... You weren't really freezing to death on the island, so you just kind of crashed under the moon um, and stars and whatnot in, in a beautiful tropical place. So um, never need a sleeping bag or anything like that. So I got a couple things here. Um, again, like just super stoked. But before I move on, like if you guys make it through this whole entire video, um, I'm just going to kind of open up everything that I've gotten so far for the trip. Uh but if you guys wanted to drop any comments and have any suggestions about um, any type of camping or the ride out there or whatever that you think will help me out, I'd really appreciate it. Any tips, tricks, any of that stuff, please, uh, please uh, bang the comments, man. Let me know what's up. But yeah, so I got all this right here. Um, it's not too much, but I got what, what came in. It's like... Uh, I got a light photography tripod stand. I actually got two of them. One is for the garage and one's for the studio. But I kind of wanted to have something that um, I kind of wanted to have something that I could kind of put the GoPro on or have something for uh, lighting because obviously in here the lighting is not that great. I'm using uh, lighting on top of the GoPro, which is all right if I'm up close, but it doesn't really capture anything you know further than a few feet. Um, so I got that going on and that's just kind of to document a lot of stuff that I got, uh, coming up for the trip to Sturgis. So I'm, I'm going to be putting a bunch of stuff on the bike as well. Uh, like a windshield, um, saddlebags, highway pegs and whatnot. So super stoked about that. Um, and then also got, what else I got, uh, anchor portable charger to take a power bank, um, some screws and whatnot and bolts, uh, for, you know, logging stuff. Um, and then obviously a tent, sleeping bag. Uh, I got a little air mattress that, believe it or not, I fit on. I'm a big guy, so definitely need that. Um, most of the stuff is on Amazon, so I'll drop all the links in the description below. But um, believe it or not, man, some of the camping gear is not cheap by any means. And uh, But I lucked out. My wife is really good at finding deals on stuff. So um, anything that you see that open up will definitely be in the, in the description below. So go check those out. Um, but man, shout out to Amazon, man. What a, what an amazing place to get everything and anything that you need for anything and everything. So yeah, but let's go ahead and, uh, unbox these bad boys and then I can get rid of all the stuff that needs to be recycled for a pickup tomorrow, but let's do it. Boom. Ding. But got a couple things. I think this is the portable charger. Super stoked though, just certain things that, you know, I've kind of just been talking to friends who travel, you know, near and far and kind of some of the stuff that they recommended, and this is one of them. So this is made by Anchor. Uh, it's a portable charger, power bank, which I'll definitely need. Um, 
you know, for the trip. So I'm not going to go into detail. I'll probably do separate videos on, on certain things, but super excited. Just something that I know that I'll need as far as like charging everything that I'll be taking my, from my phone to all my, you know, vlogging stuff, GoPros and um, my cardo pack comp system and a whole bunch of other stuff. So that's that. That's the first thing. And then I don't even know what this one is, but let's check it out. Try to be careful what I use my knife on because I don't want to cut into anything. This is hilarious. So this is something that was recommended. LED portable utility light. And you can see it's got uh, the tent <laughs> back there. But um, yeah, LED portable utility light made by Keeptronics. 5.0, it's high brightness, medium brightness, low brightness, flash lighting, SOS lighting. That's hilarious. Just in case anything gets crazy. Amazon trips me out, man. They send like the biggest boxes for absolutely the smallest things. But do your thing, Amazon. You guys can afford it. What else we got? All right. Oh, here it is. All right. So here's my sleeping bag made by Red Camp. Nicely packaged. Super tiny, man. I'm pretty stoked. That's what my biggest fear is like kind of, you know, having to take a ton of stuff on the bike and not having room. But this is really tiny for a sleeping bag. And then here's the bad boy. The sleeping go sleeping pad. Uh oh. She looks comfortable. Should be able to just blow this bad boy up. Super comfortable, two inches thick. Just saying, should be good for camping, backpacking, hiking. Yeah, pretty cool. I think it's looks like it's green. Just take it out real quick. Yeah, looks like it comes in a again easy to pack. That's so crazy that this thing fits in here. Wow, crazy. Hmm, that's gonna be easy enough to pack. That's awesome. I'm stoked about that. Nice. What else we got? Oh. This is actually a gift from my niece that she got me. The JFT product, never heard of them. But it's uh, it's an air cushion for the ride out there. I mean, it's not wild ass seats like Denver recommends, but um, yeah, pretty stoked, man. So I got this, looks like my butt will fit on there. I think you can blow it up or you can add water to this bad boy. But again, not gonna go into too crazy detail, just kind of showing some of the stuff that I got. That, it's um that's for the trip so yeah just some paperwork on it didn't come with a pump but i have one or if i decide to go water i don't know i guess we'll test both but looking forward to that shout out to my niece oh it did come with a pump what the all right so i got sleeping bag sleeping pad a little air cushion for the bike some portable lighting charger what else i got it's in here i think this is the this must be the tent this is the one i'm kind of worried about as far as for traveling doesn't look like much at all huh what and this is a two-man tent pretty cool man Extremists, I like it. It's not too heavy. And from what I was reading, it's really easy to set up and whatnot. So, pretty stoked about that. So, there's a tent. Nice. Get that down over here. And then, I think this is the tripod action. Yeah, so let's just have for the garage. Um, for recording or for lighting or whatever I want to put on here. You can put camera, GoPro, all kinds of stuff. Small box, but it's got, it was a two for one deal. Um, good price. Again, I'll put all the info for all the products that I have in the description below. Um, but yeah, two to come in bags. So again, not going to go into full detail on all these products, just kind of sharing what I got so I can get rid of these boxes. So if you follow Sets or Pendants, um, he's got a website for like Harley Hacks, it's called. Um, and it's pretty cool, man. He's got a lot of he's got a lot of great ideas, but he recommended these 
um, just for a lot of the easy like um, connections and stuff for all the products that you use for that you know we use for motor vlogging. Um, so pretty stoked about that. Cool, and they come in, and these are black. It's all about black over chrome. You never go wrong with too many bolts that you can slap on permanently. But yeah, shout out to Seth's Repentance. Go follow him. I'll put his uh, info in the description below. But he's and his website I'll put on there. But um, so he just did one with the GoPro with the media mod where you put some permanent um, like a permanent fix on the media mod to where he can literally take out the GoPro from the media mod and change out the battery like super easily, which is huge, especially if you're on the road. And I think he did a video and it showed him doing it with one hand, which, you know, he's always showing off because he's so awesome. But go check out his website. Um, another great uh, motor vlogger out there who just started a podcast not too long ago who's just killing it. So Jason, mahalo, sir. Appreciate it. All right. Well, that, that's pretty much it. Just wanted to kind of unbox this stuff so I can get all the boxes out cut them up and flatten them out and put them in the recycle. But um, also too, just to, it's, I'm doing so much better with this table um, and feeling good about uh, just getting all the, all this stuff and, and get everything ready for Sturgis. And just a huge shout out to everyone who's been supporting the channel, um, who become members and, um, you know, are paying the minimal, you know, whatever it is monthly, but it's a huge help. Um, and then also do two, I didn't realize, but doing the lives, a lot of you have really contributed a lot of money um, to the channel. And I really, really, truly do appreciate you guys. Uh, shout out to the monks, um, professional monkey and his wife, Mrs. Monkey, for they, I've been following professional monkey for a while now. And um, he did a ton of videos on Sturgis and they all took off. His channel's taken off. Um, they just reached 60,000 subscribers which is so amazing. Dude, so down to earth. Go follow them, man. They're a good time. Anyone who follows this channel, I'm pretty sure you're following Professional Monkey and, and uh, Mrs. Monkey and, and the just their YouTube journey. But they've been able to share a lot of information as far as, uh, um, you know, anything and everything Sturgis. So they've helped out a lot. And I, I can't wait to, to see them and meet them in person at Sturgis. Um, and then also to Bri the Biker Denver and everyone else who's hit me up and given me tips and uh, recommend all kinds of things for Sturgis and who've just been so supportive, um, not just with the channel, but just pumped me up about doing the trip and, uh, and all this stuff, especially my wife, man. My wife has just been just super supportive with everything. And um, you guys know that's what I'm all about. It's all about supporting everyone and just lifting everyone up and uh, and just cheering you guys on, man. That's what that's. That's what it all it is for me, man. It's just kind of just spreading that love and the law like daily to um, just to everyone, man. Uh, just because just with all the BS, I say it all the time, man. Like all the stuff going on, and I'm not gonna get into too much detail, but um, you know, just with just the stuff that took place in Texas the other day, and um, the children, uh, yeah. Um, but prayers, man, love and prayers and and all that stuff to all the families who've been affected and uh, to all the kids, man, rest in peace. And I know. Everyone. But again, just thank you so much for all that you guys do, for all the support. Um, you guys have all been way too kind and um, but keep keep sending the the messages and um, just all the words of encouragement, um, all the suggestions. Uh, I'm a grown man. So feedback is, is nothing, man. I, I want, I want it all. So positive, negative, it's all good. You know, as long as you're able to express what you feel, do so. It's cool. You can do it on this channel. I'm all good with it, but yeah, for now I got, I was able to share with you guys, um, you know, what I got planned for for Sturgis a little bit and uh, the things that I've gotten so far. I'm really stoked about the windshield. I'm really stoked about my, my saddle bag. I still haven't come across any bags yet that I'm really happy with. Um, but if you guys have any suggestions, I do have the 2020 Fat Boy. Um, so any of you guys who have that bike and uh, are rocking some solid bags that you recommend, let me know. I'm down for anything and everything. And if there's anything too that you guys think um, that I need for the trip out there, um, the trip back, or uh, just 
feel free to say, feel free to hit me up. Um, Cause yeah, I just want to make sure I'm prepared, more prepared uh, for the trip than, than not. So, but yeah, that was it. That was really quick. You guys know what to do. Stay safe, stay blessed, and let's continue to spread a little people. Cause we need it. Fat boy out. Boom.